I'm Joe. And I'm King. And this is your FRA News. Yes, go Panthers. Happy Friday, everybody. Today is November 17th, 17th. not 16th, 17th. Yes. Also, it's National Homemade Bread Day. It's a big Woo! Yeah, it's a big day. Yeah. Wow. Oh, I love well, Bread Day. This weekend, we have two FRA birthdays. Yes, we do. On Sunday. Sunday, November 19th. Happy birthday, people. Yes, happy birthday. Who's the birthday? We are car fans, car fans. and our own Garrett, Garrett Payne! Yes. 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 We love you, buddy. Yeah, we love you so much. Day. Day. Oh, yeah, that's enough. That's you're, enough. you're terrible. You're, you're not special. You are so bad. Okay. You're not special. You're a loser. Good night. Gosh, gosh. All right. Oh. Well, uh. happy birthday. So uh. you have a great weekend. <laughs> Oh God, it's sad, man. What's wrong, Jeff? My birthday is not gonna get announced this year. Why? It's in the friggin' summer. Well, Joe, Joe, it's okay, buddy. Because Joe, we started announcing half birthdays. This hey, week. all right. Because like six that. months from now, Woo! six months from now, Joe. Six months. What month will it be? It'll be May. It will be May. It'll be May. I'm man. surprised you got that, Joe. Not oh, gonna lie. thank you. Not much to talk about. I mean, it's on the script. I'm surprised. It's on you the got script. Now, my my all right. Some things. Well, anyway. You'd be surprised. Anyways, you'd anyways. be surprised. Happy half birthday to Kathy happy and Lee. Happy half birthday. It's Sunday. Elizabeth right. Hollis and Emma Flagle will celebrate their half birthdays. Mm -hmm. Thumbs up for both of y'all. Yes. Get a high five. Hope you all have a great day six months from now. Six months. Yeah. I'll tell you, you know what? The six months from now, you'll be a senior in college. That's not true. Oh, there it is. Yeah, man. That saved me, man. I know y'all want saved this one. Man. He's he knows what's going on. on. All right. We all know what that means. It's the mm. joke of the day, Siren. Joe, what's today's Friday party? Okay. I personally, brought about yours truly, was going to write a pun about bread for National Homemade Bread Day, I assume. That's right. But I thought most of you would think it was rather stale. Oh, <laughs> oh, Joe. oh man. Joe, my gosh. Shane, why are you so serious? Joe, one more joke about uh, bread and your toast. <laughs> oh, good one. Can you start to learn some things there, buddy? Yeah, good one. I'm trying, I'm trying to learn from the worst. Uh, you know, that's you. Young blood's got a young, uh, this young blood, man. Joe, this I'm, guy. So, I'm so hungry after all these bread jokes. Oh, me too, man. My stomach's hey, always growling. What's, what's for lunch? I, I always talk about food. What's, what's for lunch? Oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. This week, we're traveling from northern China all the way down to sweet old Carolina. Now, to good old Carolina, we have some Carolina style pork barbecue, some baked beans, corn on the cob, and some country coleslaw. Can I get a yee haw? Yee haw! But don't forget about those Italians because this week is pasta bar for the third week in a row. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, this week, Tucker and Bertha will have lunchroom cleanup, and I know they're excited for that. And I'm Chef Benji, and that's all for me. And I hope your day is tasty, tasty, tasty. Back to you, Joe and King. Finally switching some things up there in the kitchen, Benji. I mean, I know. I mean, finally, I mean, as as much as I love Northern China food, oh, I gotta oh. get some good old barbecue. Oh, I love barbecue. Gotta get some good old barbecue. A sandwich. Oh, all right. Nice. All right. Anyway, anyways, anyway. Yeah, don't get too far. Joe, I can talk all your ears. Joe, off. Joe, Watch Joe. Oh, oh, Got oh, a good question. Oh, oh, hold it back now. Hold it back. What's going on around the high school this week and this weekend? And weekend. Yes. Weekend. So the service club met yesterday for the spaghetti social. They did. And what if are you they know what's going on, what are they preparing for? The service Saturday, this service weekend, Saturday, baby. This weekend. It's happening on Saturday from yes. 9 to yes. 11. It's very, it's very exciting. We hope you can make it there Try to. Uh, to help stop hunger. Yes. Well, Kingston, the football team the football played team. wonderful. Amazing. They, they had the best season of their lives. And I would like to appreciate their hard work with the top five plays of the year. Top five. And here's Garrett with the highlights. Da 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 da. And for our number five play this year from the football season, we have an Eric Stock still dig 61 yard touchdown pass. Yes, 61 yards all the way to Lance Wilhoy as he cruises right on into the end zone. And look at this celebration. Woo! By Lance and Riley. The number four play this year is yet another Eric Stock still digs touchdown pass. This time, 90 yards. Yes, 90 yards. That's what I said. He drops back and throws a screen pass to Kane and Catlett as he gets a really nice block from Tyman Mitchell as he goes down the sideline and look at that no one is even close to catching him he shows off his speed as he cruises 90 yards into the end zone once again for the Panthers the number three play from this year is another Eric Soxel Dix pass this time to Lance Wilhoit 
and it's not a touchdown, but Lance shows off his hands with a beautiful one-handed catch. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That's a beauty right there. For the number two play this year, the defense showing off their catching seals as Riley Speed. Yes, Riley Speed takes an interception 90 yards. Look at that. Ooh, he gets it, and he cruises down. He goes 90 yards for the pick six. Look at him breaking tackles, shifty around the edge, and he knows right there nobody's going to catch him. He's going to go all the way. He's got Lance right there in front of him. Riley is all the way. Another touchdown for the Panthers. And your number one play from this season is an Eric Stocksville Diggs touchdown run. Not a pass, a run. Look at him, shift around the pocket, making everybody miss, and he cruises down the sideline with nobody there to catch him. He's gonna go 76 yards. Yes, 76 yards in the touchdown scamper for a touchdown Panthers. Those are our top five players from this year's football season. Tonight, our very own Benjamin Blavitz and the hockey team plays at Bridgestone Arena at 6.45 p.m. Don't forget, there is free parking in the 6th Avenue garage. Make sure to take advantage of that. The girls and boys basketball team has just started up and they will have games next week on both Monday and Tuesday at home. So make sure to come on out and support. We hope you can make it to all those games and the theme for the games will be determined very soon. Well, go Panthers! Woo! Thank you, Garrett. Thank you. It is now time for the riddle of the week. But first, we would. We would. We would. I congratulate last week's winner, last week. Jaden Hosford! As Farquaad. If you went to the play, the little Black Shrek, Shrek special. That was hilarious. He enjoyed so, it. He enjoyed man. the play. I was laughing my butt off. It was hilarious. Anyways, anyways, anyways. You could hear me, hear me clap. Right. It was that good. Anyways. Mm, anyways. Congratulations. We had a great day at FRA. Yes. All right. So, King, tell the folks that are listening right now. All what right. the riddle is. All right. Well, Joe, before we get there, oh, I would like to announce that we are changing the riddle up just a little, just, just, just a little, just a little, changing just it up. a tad, just a little. All right. So how so, King? Okay? All right. Instead of a boring old riddle, Man. Uh, we are going to give a fun fact about hey. a teacher here at FRA. Hey, nice. And the audience, that's you. That's you. We'll have to email King and Joe at gmffrastudents.com on the screen. Yeah. The teacher that corresponds to that fun fact given. That's right. Yeah. So King. Wait. They still have to email after wait, lunch. After lunch. Not 1240. It is 1240. But they can email at 1241, right? If you email before 1240. Oh, there's gonna be some repercussions and consequences count. up in here. Repercussions. Telling you unless, what? We like, unless you're Jack Poe, then we will count. Yes, yeah, so you're Jack Poe, then you hey, can email right now. He's Jack Poe. Email Jack right Poe, now. Email right now. Go, hey, Jack, get on your phone right now. I see Don't. you. I see you on your phone anyway. He's on so. his phone. He's on his phone, team. Hey, hey, ho, ho, ho. Uh, okay, so. okay. Anyway. All right, here it is. What is it? There? This teacher has been kicked out of an all you can eat buffet oh. because this teacher ate too much food. Joe, do you know who that is? Oh, I couldn't even tell you who that is, man. Joe, who I, is it? Yes, you do know. I, I told you like 10 minutes ago who it was. Oh wait! Don't don't tell them. Oh, oh I got don't it! I got it. it. Okay. okay. All right. Oh, oh man! That, you Anyways. know what that's, that brings to the end of our show. It, that's the end of the show. Gosh! Like it's just you know it's, it's oh. sad. Anyway, he, he's Joe. I I'm not Joe for the second week in a row. But at least I'm King, so you know it makes sense. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. Um, thanks for watching, and have a great day at FRA. You know, if you want to, have a good day. Joe, you know, get a high five in your hallway. But uh, besides that. And,